Imagine spending months in complete isolation, with no clocks, no sunlight, and no way to track the passage of time. For most of us, it sounds like a nightmare, but for one man, it was an experiment that changed the way we think about time itself. In 1972, Michel Siffry, a French scientist, entered a cave 440 feet below the surface of the Earth. For six long months, he lived without any time references, no natural light, no clocks, only darkness. His goal? To uncover the secrets of the human body's internal clock and to see how living without time would affect his body and mind. Little did he know, his journey would redefine our understanding of time and human perception forever. Sifri's work helped establish the field of chronobiology, the study of the body's biological rhythms. His experiments revealed that time, as we perceive it, is not an objective reality but something that our bodies and minds interpret based on external cues. This is the story of Michel Sifri, a man who dared to step into the unknown and emerged with discoveries that would change science forever. Michel Sifri's Early Life and First Experiment Michel Sifri's journey into the world of time perception began long before his famous cave experiments. Born in 1939, he grew up with a fascination for exploration and science. Sifri initially trained as a geologist, and in 1961, while studying an underground glacier in the French Alps, he got the idea that would change his life. He decided to spend an extended period in total isolation to study how time, without external references like the sun, would affect him. In 1962, Sifri conducted his first experiment in a cave in the Alps, spending two months alone in the dark. He had no watch, no clock, and no idea of how much time had passed. During this experiment, Sifri would only sleep, eat, and wake up based on how he felt, without any influence from external time cues. Unbeknownst to him, this was the start of his revolutionary contribution to the study of human chronobiology. The results were groundbreaking. By the time he emerged, Sifri discovered that his perception of time had completely warped. Though he thought only one month had passed, in reality, he had been underground for two months. This was the first clue that humans, like many animals, possess an internal biological clock that governs our sense of time. The discovery of the human time warp. After the success of his first experiment, Sifri was determined to dive deeper into the mysteries of human time perception. He began to wonder whether all humans experience time in the same way and whether external factors like sunlight and clocks were necessary to maintain a regular 24-hour cycle. To test this, Sifri conducted more experiments, sending various individuals into caves for weeks or months at a time. What he discovered was astonishing. Without any external cues, many participants naturally shifted into a 48-hour cycle, with 36 hours of wakefulness followed by 12 hours of sleep. This time warp effect suggested that the human body could adapt to longer days and nights if isolated from traditional time references. In one of his most famous experiments in 1972, Sifri himself returned to a cave, this time in Midnight Cave near Del Rio, Texas. For six months, he lived completely isolated from the world, with no way to tell time. The only contact he had with the outside world was a telephone line through which he would occasionally report his activities. When he woke up, when he ate, and when he went to sleep. His team above ground tracked time and monitored his condition, but they never told him the actual time. This isolation was complete. Over the six months, Sifri's body began to follow an unpredictable rhythm. Some days, he would stay awake for 36 hours, followed by 12 hours of sleep. Other days, he would sleep for as little as two hours or as long as 18 hours, with no clear pattern. His perception of time was completely distorted. When he finally emerged from the cave on what his team told him was September 5, 1972, Sifri believed it was only August. Two months had passed in his mind, but in reality, he had been underground for nearly double that time. The Biological Clock and Its Implications Sifri's work not only uncovered the internal workings of the human biological clock, but it also had far-reaching implications for the fields of medicine, military science, and even space travel. His discovery that humans have an internal rhythm independent of external time cues revolutionized our understanding of how the body functions in isolation and extreme conditions. The French military took a keen interest in Sifri's work, particularly in how soldiers could extend their waking hours without detrimental effects. The idea of creating a 48-hour wake-sleep cycle for soldiers, where they could stay alert for longer periods during combat, was explored in further experiments. Similarly, NASA saw the potential in Sifri's findings, 
especially as they planned long-duration space missions where astronauts would be removed from natural day-night cycles. Sifri's work provided key insights into how humans might adapt to the challenges of living in space. Sifri's findings also opened the door to studying sleep disorders, jet lag, and other phenomena related to the disruption of the body's natural rhythms. Understanding the biological clock became essential for improving health and well-being in modern society. The Psychological Effects of Time Deprivation While Sifri's experiments were largely scientific, they also provided deep insights into the psychological effects of time deprivation. Over the course of his experiments, Sifri experienced profound changes in his mental state. He reported that time seemed to blur together, and he often lost track of how long he had been awake or asleep. His isolation led to periods of depression and anxiety, and his memory became unreliable. In his interviews, Sifri would later describe how time in isolation feels like one long day. Without external markers to differentiate between morning and night, the passage of time becomes almost meaningless. He noted that memory plays a crucial role in how we perceive time, and without regular events to anchor ourselves in reality, time seems to slip away. This psychological toll of time isolation raised important questions about the future of long-term space travel and extreme environments. How would astronauts, submariners, or other isolated workers cope with the loss of time cues? Sifri's research suggested that, while the body could adapt to different time cycles, the mind might struggle to do the same. The Legacy of Michel Sifri Michel Sifri's work has left a lasting legacy in science, particularly in the field of chronobiology. His discoveries about the human biological clock and time perception have been foundational for understanding everything from sleep patterns to mental health. Today, his experiments are still studied by scientists around the world, and they continue to inform research on how the human body functions in space, under extreme conditions, and in modern life where artificial light often disrupts our natural rhythms. Sifri's journey wasn't just about science, it was about pushing the boundaries of human endurance and curiosity. His willingness to spend months in isolation, cut off from the world, taught us valuable lessons about the nature of time, the human body, and the mind. His work reminds us that time, something we often take for granted, is far more complex and mysterious than we realize. Time is an illusion. In the end, Michel Sifri's experiments showed us that time, as we experience it, is an illusion. Our bodies and minds are not bound by the 24-hour day that governs our lives. Instead, they operate on their own rhythms, shaped by biology, environment, and perception. Sifri's work challenges us to rethink what we know about time and opens up new possibilities for how we live and work in the future. As we continue to explore the mysteries of time and space, Michel Sifri's groundbreaking discoveries will remain a guiding light, showing us that the most profound truths often lie in the darkest places. If you're fascinated by this story of time, science, and human endurance, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. Stay tuned for more deep dives into the world's greatest scientific mysteries, historical events, and human achievements.